are watching what's up in makeup welcome back lots of stuff to share with you this week in top news ColourPop is coming out with liquid lipsticks first it was the eyeshadow then it was the blush and the bronzer and the highlighters and now we're jumping on the liquid lipstick six dollars each just like a lot of the ColourPop products there are swatches all over instagram if you're interested in seeing what those are like there are going to be 25 shades all together and they're supposedly going to be available this coming week. Woohoo! All right, moving on to some YouTube news. Mac Daddy has shown us a few products that he's working on, including a couple of liquid lipsticks from his brand, Artist Couture. We see four shades on his desk in his Instagram post, but there's no release date as of yet. Thanks to my friend Kiki on the What's Up and Makeup app for the heads up on this one. Kiki also shared with us some gorgeous highlighters from Anastasia. According to the Makeup Fangirls blog, these are going to be hitting stores in August. Urban Decay has released a new palette at Sephora. It's called Wendy's Contraband. It has been created by Urban Decay's chief creative officer and founding partner, Wendy. I'm not going to butcher your last name, Wendy. There are six eyeshadows. The shades are Trick, which is a light metallic pinky copper shimmer with tonal micro sparkle, and then Smog, which we've seen before, I believe. A deep coppery bronze shimmer, Rain, which is a rich brown satin, Deep End, which is a bright teal, Flash, which is a bright iridescent purple, and Tornado, which is a vibrant deep purple shimmer. That also comes with a 24-7 glide on eye pencil in zero. MAC has also released some new products. Uh, actually, it's a twist on an old favorite. The Prep and Prime Fix Plus takes on a new twist with the introduction of five limited edition scents, including Romantic Rose, Calming lavender, energizing yuzu, and cooling cucumber, along with the last one, which is called creamy coconut. The benefits, according to MAC, are vitamins and minerals to give us the skin an instant boost of moisture, an infusion of green tea, chamomile, and cucumber to soothe, and a lightweight formula that helps your complexion look refreshed and finished. In Sephora news this week, Bare Minerals has released a Work Weekend Wow Ready Eye Shadow Palette. It's $26. It's limited edition, and it can also be found at Ulta. This does come with a step-by-step -step guide for each look from natural to smoky and evening looks. Becca has a new shadow and light brow contour mousse for $24. There are two shades, one for light to medium hair colors and one for medium to dark hair. The brow enhancing mousse side, which is the darker shade, thickens and fills in gaps and extends the brows with fibers that adhere to existing brow hairs and the skin. The arch defining cream, which is the highlighter shade, the one that looks a little bit pinky. It accentuates and sharpens for perfectly defined brows. Now, a ton of skincare items at Sephora new this week. The first one is by Fresh. It's a limited edition face mask essentials trio for $80. You get a one ounce black tea instant perfecting mask, a one ounce fresh rose face mask, and a 4.4 ounce fresh sugar face polish. Also, Dr. Dennis Gross has a skincare kit. It is called the Age Defying Solutions Kit. It's $185, but you get a ton of stuff. You get 45 two-step alpha beta peel extra strength formula peel pads, one ounce of ferulic acid plus retinol brightening solution, and a 1.7 ounce ferulic plus retinol anti-aging moisturizer. Josie Moran also has a kit where you can do a little bit of customizing. This one is called the Cleanse Nourish Pick Your Protect Kit. It's $68. You get a six ounce argan cleansing oil, a 1.7 ounce 100% pure argan oil, and then you get to choose between the argan daily moisture SPF 47 protect and perfect or a two ounce argan daily moisturizer in SPF 47. Origins has a new mask with rose clay. It's $25. It's a two-in-one purifying mask and skin refiner that's formulated with Canadian willow herb, Persian silk tree, and a potent blend of actives to smooth, refine pores, and boost skin's overall quality. The Essential Anti-Agers Kit is also available from Origins. That's only $20. It's limited edition. It's online only. You get a one ounce plant scription anti-aging cleanser, a 0.5 ounce modern friction nature's gentle dermabrasion, a 0.5 ounce plant scription anti-aging power serum, and a one ounce drink up intensive overnight mask. Peter Thomas Roth, this one looks amazing. It is a Hall of Fame kit. It's $38, but you get some huge products in there. You get an 8.5 ounce strawberry scrub, an 8.5 ounce anti-aging cleansing gel, a five ounce cucumber gel mask, a 
5.7 ounce Max Sheer Daily SPF 30 and a 1 ounce Instant Firm XI. Some skincare from Bare Minerals. This is called the Discover Mineral Elixirs 30 Day Skin Nourishing Collection. It's $30. It's limited edition and online only. You get the facial cleansing oil, the 5 oil blend, and the eye nourishing oil balm. Two more things in skincare at Sephora. The Vita Liberata Fabulous Tinted Self Tanning Mousse. It's $40. It's exclusive to Sephora. This is a larger size, super fast drying tan mousse that gives an instant color and then develops to a beautiful natural looking tan that lasts up to seven days. And then finally, Dr. Brandt has some skincare for VIB and VIB rouges only. This is the Pore Dermabrasion Pore Perfecting Exfoliator for $58. It's a unique professional grade physical and chemical exfoliator and pore perfecter in one. In Ulta News, Bare Minerals has that same eyeshadow palette that was, is selling at Sephora, but they also have a lip set. It is called the Work Weekend Wow Marvelous Moxie Lip Trio. It's $32. You get three different shade options where you get a lipstick, a lip gloss, and a lip liner together. So those shade options are nude, mauve, and pink. You also get a makeup pouch with that set. Coming on June 23rd, Stila has a new mascara called the Huge Extreme Lash Mascara. They call it a revolutionary lash lightweight, ink-like, volumizing mascara that instantly drenches lashes in the deepest black and builds color for the most dramatic lash look. In drugstore news, a lot of things from Essie this week. I found all of these on the Ulta website. Essie has a couple of kits. One is called the Silk Watercolor Swept Away Nail Look Kit. The description looks very, very ordinary, but if you look at the box, it looks anything but ordinary. They've got this crazy watercolor looking swatch up in the corner. I don't know what is going on with this kit. I wish Ulta would describe it a little bit better, but it looks really, really cool. You can see that it's got all the primary colors there, which makes me think that you can really mix these colors together to make some custom shades. So I would really like to know more about this. I wish Ulta did a better job describing it. There's also another kit called the Silk Watercolor Abstract Floral Nail Look Kit. Again, the description looks very ordinary, but if you look at the swatch up in the corner, it looks beautiful. So I'm really curious about these kits. I hope that I can see some reviews soon because they're so neat looking. Also, Essie has released the Cashmere Matte Brights Nail Polish Collection. There are four matte pastel colors in that collection. A few products from Rimmel. The first is the Exaggerate Smoke and Shine Gel Eyeliner. It's a gel formula in an automatic retractable pencil. There's four shades in Little Black Smoky, Copper Bling, Purple Craze, and Blue Steel. They say that it gives a high shine smoky look. Along with this eyeliner, Rimmel has now released the Scandal Eyes X Extreme Mascara in extreme black only. It gives an extreme high impact volume and endless dramatic length. If you look at the brush, it's really, really interesting. I've never seen a brush brush, a wand, whatever you want to call it, quite like this before. The arch side volumizes and loads up the lashes for an extreme look. And then the flat side defines and lengthens lashes from root to tip. My friend Red Hearted Makeup on Instagram has kind of reposted a repost of this Disney collection that I have to share with you. It is called the Dare to Dream Collection. This is a repost from Megaladonna's Instagram account. And if you want to see more more of this collection, you can go to Smash Bravo's Instagram account. I'm going to put the, the names of those down below if you want to go to Instagram and see more about this collection. Their new Disney Princess makeup collections are only going to be found at Walgreens. It looks like Pocahontas, Mulan, and Ariel are going to be spotlighted in this collection. There are some bronzers, some eyeshadow books, all kinds of things that look really, really interesting. It doesn't look like Elf is involved in this one. I don't see Elf's name anywhere on the packaging that I can see, but it might be e.l.f. I don't know. It's really hard to tell, but I did want to share it with you, even though I do have limited information on this collection. In high-end news, Guerlain has the Terra de Ete Tan Enhancing Bronze for Summer 2015 collection, starting with the Terracotta Terra de Ete Tan Enhancing Bronzer. It's $78, and isn't it gorgeous? I don't know about $78, but it's really, really, really pretty. They say it has two shades that come together to warm all skin tones with a natural looking radiant glow and adapt seamlessly to a developing tan. It's scented with a note of TR flower and is housed in a mirrored compact. It's available now at Nordstrom and Saks. Christian Louboutin has some new Scarabee inspired nail colors for June of 2000. 
2015. Those are so interesting. Oh my goodness, they're crazy looking. They're based on the scarab beetle from ancient Egypt. They're all iridescent colors, but as you know, this brand is very, very expensive. They're $50 for each nail polish, but they really are beautiful to admire from afar. The shades available are a nude pink gold, a violet blue, and a green bronze. Those are available at Sephora, Neiman Marcus, Saks, and Nordstrom. At Beautylish this week, if you are a high-end brush fan, this set may be for you. Chikahoto is known for their amazing quality handcrafted brushes. They have designed a collection with Beautylish. This limited edition brush set will be available on July 2nd and the brushes are available to ship worldwide. It is a five-piece brush set designed by Beautylish and handcrafted by Chikahoto's team of artisans in Japan. Once again, thank you to Kiki on the What's Up and Makeup app. Here is a quick shot of Dior's new blushes that aren't quite out yet. They are the fall collection. I'm not sure where she found this image, but it looks really, really pretty. In HS and news there is a new combo if you're interested in the becca highlighting and bronzing products it is the summer shimmer perfecting duo for 27 dollars. it is free shipping you get a 0.2 ounce beach tint shimmer souffle and watermelon and moonstone it's a coral red infused with pale gold and a 0.68 ounce shimmering skin perfector in opal which is a golden pearl in qvc news we have laura geller's baked mousse three weld eyeshadow palette for 29 dollars plus $3 shipping and handling. It comes in your choice of two color combinations, including raspberry mousse and chocolate souffle. It is a baked mousse palette that includes three eyeshadows with a weightless, ultra blendable texture, a creamy color that dries in a comfortable featherweight texture, no drying or flaking with a soft pearl finish. You can apply these with a finger or with this very interesting silicone paddle. I don't know, but supposedly they blend very, very, very well. In natural and organic news, 100% Pure has a bunch of new products, including the Honey Cream Wash in seven scents, including coconut, blood orange, French lavender, vanilla bean, eucalyptus, gingerade, and honey almonds. And then finally, a new Jasmine Green Tea Moisturizer. And then finally, we come to events and deals. In events news this week, we have at Nordstrom's the NARS Mega event featuring the NARS Stylist team, the NARS team will be offering exclusive one-on-one -on -one beauty sessions where they will teach you tips and tricks customized just for you space is limited you, you want to make sure you reserve your appointment ahead of time quite a few sales going on in the makeup world especially the high-end makeup world at smashbox they have their friends and family 25 percent off sale use code sbx friends at checkout for that deal also ysl is having the private sale uh, it is 20 percent off any order of 75 dollars or more with complimentary shipping and then Giorgio Armani has the 20% off any order deal and $75 or more of a purchase gives you complimentary shipping. On Groupon this week for $4.97, you can get the $18 e.l.f. Cosmetics Beauty Book Shimmer Eyeliner and Shimmer Gloss Set. Also the Bobbi Brown Longwear Gel Eyeliner Duo. Those $25 at Sephora and here they are on quite a discount. I will put the image of that there. And then finally, Cargo Cosmetics has the Double Agent Concealer for $15 instead of $32. Our deals and events reporter Nicole has found one of her favorite brands, June Jacobs, at 6pm.com. The product that is on sale there is the Spa Collection Lemon Sugar Body Polish. It's 69% off for only $15 instead of $48. I will link that down below. And that's it for What's Up in Makeup this week. Thank you so much for watching and thanks as always to our What's Up in Makeup reporters and contributors. I've got a long list this week. Thank you so much to everyone. Lily Spurgeon, Nicole at Yay or Nay, Nicole, Leanne Fleck, Megan Robertson, Yesenia Cuerva, Susan W., Danae at Bashful, Danae, Maria at Agape Love Girl, Shannon at Musings of a Cat, Beauty Hall 411 on Instagram, Becca at, at Dandelion Basics on Instagram, Kiki at Kiki809 on Instagram, and YRC Photo on Instagram. Thank you so much for your help this week. I could not 
not have done it without you. And as typical, we are going to have the What's Up in Makeup chat this morning from 10 a.m. Eastern Time to 11 a.m. Eastern Time. Even though it's Father's Day, we are going to go ahead and go for it. And But I got to cut it off at 11 because I got to go spend time with the husband and the kiddos. Also, an update on the What's Up in Makeup app. The creator of the app has told me that the Android version should be available sometime in July. Let's cross our fingers. Just a reminder, I have basically this much control over how the app is designed. It's all up to the creator. So I will put in all of your suggestions on what we should be doing with the app, but I have no personal control over anything as I did not purchase the app. It was offered to me. So please be patient with me with the app. And as far as the features and how they all work, I am putting in your suggestions, but there's only so much that I control. But I am having so much fun using the app with you guys. Uh, we are developing such a wonderful community over there. I believe there's about 700 of us over there right now, and I hope there will be more people contributing. One thing I love about it so far is it's such a safe place to upload your photos of your nails of the day, your faces of the day. Um, it's not like Instagram where you're competing with a bunch of professionals. We're just regular people where imperfections are embraced and appreciated. We just care about learning about new products from each other and developing such a wonderful community over there. So thank you to the 700 or so of you that have downloaded the app. Without you, there is no community. So I thank you all so much for being a part of it. And those of you that are waiting for Android, it's coming as fast as he can get it to come. So... Oh, hopefully soon we'll even, uh, we'll probably end up doubling those numbers at least uh, once the Android release has been released because that's what happens with releases. They are released. As far as new products that I want to show you, I had a request to show you some new products. Unfortunately, I can't show you products that were in this week's episode because they're brand new this week, but I do want to show you just a preview of some of the e.l.f. products that I got. I got the new e.l.f. Uh, eyeshadow palettes. I got all of them. I also got the Contour and Bronzing Kit Girlfriend. This is the one I'm wearing on my eyes today. Oh my goodness. Honestly, these are awesome. I am so excited. This shade is a total bust, but oh Oh my gosh. Just, are you kidding me, Elf? Are you kidding me? The nude one is amazing. Those are the two I've used so far. I am going to be doing a full review on all of these products as far as just the preview of the contour kit. I feel like this is kind of versatile for a lot of skin tones. This highlight shade is my exact skin tone, so this will be better for medium skin tones. The highlight, of course, is good for anyone. Uh, I feel like these are better for uh, medium to lighter skin tones, so that's the, that's the um, contour kit. And then here's the bronzer kit. Um, overall, just absolutely loving these products. I mean, I just, I can't believe how pigmented they are, how easy they are to use. If I had to pick between the bronzer palette and the contour palette, I would probably pick the contour palette, but the bronzer palette is really nice as well. I don't think that you need both. I think that one or the other is going to be fine. But I, again, I am going to be doing a full review of all these palettes once I've tried them all, but I figured I would just kind of give you a little bit of a preview of what I've used so far. Oh, the other thing that I wear is it this here? This is the, the color changing lipstick. Don't don't waste your money in my opinion. Um, it dried my lips out something terrible. Uh, the color changing aspect is kind of cool, but you, if, unless you plan on keeping reapplying this all day long, like every hour, I would not recommend the um, Gotta Glow lip tint at all. Um, but again, full review coming soon. So as a reward for watching this video all the way to the end, you get that little elf preview. I thank you so much for watching. You are awesome. Mad love, and I will see you in the next video. Bye! Wendy, and she is the founding partner all of, ah, come on. You can do this, Jen. We're not gonna be editing forever today. You can do this. I'm filming, can you guys be quiet, please? And a 1.7 ounce ferulic plus, ferulic plus retinol. Yeah. And a one ounce ferulic plus retinol. <laughs> come on, lips. It's just not working together today. 47 per protect and perfect. Mash mascara. It's the mash mascara. And you get the six ounce argan. I'm just gonna start that again. Sorry, Jen, that's editing.